Hey guys, uh, just go through Friday's class with you. So uh, first thing is external rotations. So taking a weight, whether if you have a dumbbell, small plate, or just any object at all. Okay, it is sitting down. Okay, knee bent, so tucking one knee in, elbow resting right on top, driving the elbow down. Okay, and from there, remember all the movement is coming in that shoulder joint, controlled all the way down and back up keeping that wrist in a nice strong position as well so you're going to do eight to each side with that once you have that done it is a banded lat stretch if you are able to okay so if you have a band you can attach it to something okay so it is hand coming up underneath if i'm doing my right side stepping back with my right leg okay half kneeling position keeping your back nice and straight letting the band pull you in and then just lowering my chest right down towards my knee rotate your hand away if you can increase the stretch if you don't have access to a band or being able to do that what you can do is the same time so you can do this in a kneeling position or you can do it standing and again if you don't have a a, a bar or something or even the table to do this against you just do it up against the wall okay so you're going to come down hands in front and go down into a kneeling position okay and then from there we're just going to push your head and chest right down through tucking that pelvis under okay getting a nice big stretch all across t-spine down into our lats as well so can be down, done from a standing position either all the way down or we can go up against the wall or a table whatever it might be is that okay you're just going to hold that for 40 seconds or so and then the last thing we're going to do is just a calf stretch okay so calf stretch foot up okay we want to get our heel in as close as we possibly can against the wall whatever it might be that we're using okay toe pointed up try not to let that move and then from there we're bringing our hips and your chest all the way right in so it is not sitting back like this okay all the way right in bringing a chest in as well is that okay and you hold that for 30 seconds on each side that's it same as usual then just about two to three rounds of that as best you can and once you've that done it is into our mecon so mecon for today okay is a 15 minute amrap so as many rounds as possible in 15 minutes pace yourself through this this is going to get really tough on shoulders okay so you are doing 12 push presses single arm push presses on the left 12 single arm push presses on the right and then it is followed by skipping it is either 100 single skips 30 double unders or 20 single single double unders okay so that's one round trying to get as many rounds done in 15 minutes as possible so our push press okay taking our weight can be whatever it is kettlebell dumbbell whatever you have okay if you don't have one of these try and be inventive use something okay that you're able to get a grip of and being able to push up overhead remember we want to challenge you but not too difficult you're gonna to have to do 12 reps of this each time on both sides and probably a lot of rounds as well okay so getting in to a front rack position remember it is just a push press so it is a dip and drive okay so remember we want to be almost sliding your back along a wall so it's that dip and then that explosive kind of motion to throw that weight up remember to punch the weight up don't come to a stop dip and then stop and then try and do a strict press so it is dip and punching that weight all the way up overhead pull that weight down dip and punching that weight up overhead is that okay so you'll do 12 on one side 12 on the other side then it's into our skipping okay it's 100 single skips 30 double unders or 20 single single double unders if you don't have a skipping rope okay what we can do is just get yourself a line on the ground okay and we're just going to hop over and back for 100 is that okay so there's 15 minutes as many rounds as possible that pace yourself with this one this is going to get really tricky on the shoulders okay that's it super work guys um and hope to see you